Morning everybody, Mr Fuller again. Here's another warm-up exercise that I use quite a lot. I've been using for years these, these exercises. They're really good when you start off a practice session. Just to get your fingers warmed up, okay? And it'll help you develop independent movement for your fingers. So what I'm doing is this. So I'm starting on the fifth fret of the sixth bottom string, string six. So I'm going five, six, seven, eight. And then on the fifth string, I'm doing the same pattern. Five, six, seven, eight. And on the fourth string in the same pattern. Five, six, seven, eight. And then I'm coming backwards, starting on the fourth string of fret eight. Eight, seven, six, five, eight, seven, six, five, eight, seven, six, five. So the whole thing goes. Make sure your fingers are quite close to the strings. You don't want to be having your fingers, flipping your fingers off like a lot of people do when they first start. You need your fingers close to the strings. You don't want them out here, okay? So that's the pattern there. So when you're quite happy playing it like that, using your right hand for up and down, shift it up to the fifth string, do the same pattern over the next three strings. So that's and then shift it up to the fourth string. Eventually you'll be able to play all six. And of course you can move it around. And again. And you don't have to start on the bottom string, you can start on the top string, you could start there. Come backwards and then go forwards. Okay, you're just looking to get your little finger into play and getting your independence into your fingers. It's a nice little warm up exercise, okay? It's very simple to do as well. And you can do lots of variations on it, okay? And we might talk about them another time. Okay, bye for now.